This mastering physics is something that didn't exist when I was teaching. I had teaching assistants. I had enormous work to do. I was so dedicated, I took on that work and, and did it. If, we, if at that time I had had a mastering physics program, my job would have been so much easier. And also, you know, the, it, your homework is put on there. The next time questions, that's something I didn't mention, they're on there. Another nice thing about the mastering physics, though, is that it, it allows the, <clears throat> the instructor to know what's going on, what they know and what they don't know. It used to be would shoot from the hip and say, pre present some idea and then say, okay, and then go, go and say, okay, and, and as an observer, someone would say, wait a minute, you keep saying, okay, how do you know it's okay? Did they really get that? With the mastering physics, they will know, they will have a handle on what they got, at least from, since the last, the last lecture. And that's, that's a beauty of that. I want to tell you about the videos. I have a friend, David Vasquez, and David Vasquez has done a lot of the uh, simulations that are used in the mastering physics. Dave Vasquez came into my, my, uh, my home one time and he says, Paul, he says, would you mind if I come into your class with a video you? camera? <laughs> I want to do a master's thesis on media arts and I want to videotape some segments of your class and talk about what is the secret that you have that gets so many students coming every semester. Would that be okay? That's true, sure, that'd be okay, fine. So he came in with a camera and his friend Craig Dawson, and instead of doing just a couple of classes, they decided to do the whole course. Then they went over to the University of Hawaii, and they said, uh, Hewitt, will you do us a favor? What is it? Would you mind teaching uh, one of your classes in the TV studio? And then I said, oh, by the way, would you mind if I bring some some umatic tapes this was way back in the umatic tape days some masters and have some for myself no that'd be okay i said well it'll be commercial because it'll be to promote conceptual physics i want teachers to see how i'm teaching this course rather than just explaining it in paragraphs that sort of thing with this mastering physics program the teacher has so much available there that all we've got to do is to get the students interested in the course, not getting through the course, but finding that it's interesting. I say this, if you use the videos and use the ancillaries that Pearson applies and the mastering physics, if you use these things, you will have success your first time teaching if you have a knack for teaching well. If you can teach well, you'll be able to teach physics the first time you try.